On January 20th, 2009, Barack Obama became the 44th President of the United States. It was a very important day in our country's history. Being president is a pretty big job, and becoming president takes lots of hard work. President Barack Obama is a hero of freedom and the first African-American president of the United States. How did he do it? It's a really interesting story, and we'd like to share it with you. You'll learn all about President Obama's life and his dreams, and you'll learn some fun facts about him too. Ready? Let's get started. President Obama's Parents We'll begin President Barack Obama's story on the continent of Africa, in the country of Kenya. That's where his father was born and raised. President Obama's father's name was Barack Hussein Obama. He lived in Kenya until he was old enough to go to college. That's when he traveled to the United States to study at the University of Hawaii. President Obama's mother was born in America's Midwest, Kansas. Her name was Ann Dunham. She attended the University of Hawaii, too. They met, and soon after, Barack Obama and Ann Dunham were married. A couple of years later, in 1961, they had a baby boy. They named him after his father, Barack Hussein Obama. When he was just a young boy, Barack's father moved from Hawaii to Boston, Massachusetts to attend Harvard University. But he didn't have enough money to bring the whole family, so young Barack and his mom stayed in Hawaii. It's very hard for any family to be apart, and it was very hard for President Obama's family too. And sadly, his parents ended up getting a divorce. Soon after that, Barack's father went back to live and work in Kenya. He wanted to make things better for the people who lived there. His mom got married again. She married a man from the country of Indonesia. His name was Lolo Soatoro. It was a big change in Barack Obama's life. Now here's a fun fact about President Barack Obama. President Obama's favorite board game is, do you know? It's not checkers, it's not Monopoly, it's Scrabble. The life of young Barack Obama. Have you ever moved to a new house, a new town, a new school? If you have, then you know how hard it can be to leave your home, your family, and your friends. Well, when President Obama was just six years old, Barack, his mom, and her new husband moved far, far away to a different country, Indonesia. Indonesia was a very poor country, and as a young boy, President Obama learned how difficult life was for the poor people who lived there. But he did learn some cool stuff too. In Indonesia, Barack learned how to fly kites and catch grasshoppers. President Obama lived in Indonesia until he was 10 years old. Then, he moved back to Hawaii to live with his grandparents. In Hawaii, he went to the Punahou Academy. He was one of only a few black students at the school. 